years ago, I tried to beat Rim of Madness by creating a cult and becoming chosen to every deity. Yeah, that didn't go so well. We're gonna try that again. <laughs> okay, so a couple of things. One, the goal is start off as tribal, become chosen to every deity, and then summon an old one. How we get to that point, well, yeah. There is, however, one caveat. No cowardly tactics. We ain't building into a mountain. Not doing that again. Okay, let's see. What would be a good spot? Hmm... I think I want an area that we're... Di it's a year-round growing period. I think I'd want that. On the other hand, I am going to need to get a little close. I don't know who they are. Hmm... You know what? Uh, no, wait, that's a tropical rainforest. I don't think we want to be in there. That's not a good location. Yeah, I'm not digging this. Possibly friendly, but mm. Ten days out of the year, that doesn't grow very well. I think that's worth it. So, yeah. We'll play of large hills. Yeah, so, we got the Asari Union. 30th Alliance Fleet. These guys. Some Elders. But, you know, we also got a few people who don't really like us. Alright, so what are we playing as? The Order of the Eye of Knowledge. We're cannibals, we worship the old ones. We also believe in Necrolati. I mean, we're, we're kind of crazy. After all, we know the truth. We know what's out there. And we plan to summon them. We know we're gonna die. We're gonna spread a religion like it gets no tomorrow. Fuck anyone else. They'll smoke them if you got them. We're killing them. We're eating them. 
Yeah. I can't add any more. And our relics. Of course, we gotta have the Necronomicon. I mean, that would be weird if we didn't. The, the Shining Trepo... Trepozahedron? Zepohedron? Trepozahedron? That's a, that's a weird name. A weird gem. And a piece of the end of time. A legendary artifact that holds the path, a piece of, of the last dying star that has turned cold. At least that's the le how the legend goes. It could just be a really powerful weapon. And we venerate the black goats. Uh, yeah, so this should be fun. Now then, who is our crew? We have Gru, who is the, an accursed child and lore keeper. He's the one who discovered these troops, and these people are the only others he trusted. Salamander, who's a confident masochist, but a bit of a pyro, hence his name. He's He wouldn't have come along and this old guy was random, and this is who I got. When I saw that crafting and the cooking skill, I knew I could deal with him being a bit of a pyro. Yeah, Gru is the only one who I made, just so we have somebody who's intelligent and social, just in case. We have Teresa, early riser. She's tough. She's good at mining. And pretty good at construction, too. Definitely a good gunner. Humberto. Great memory. A bit neurotic, but he's pretty quick on the uptick. He doesn't have much to do, but being a jogger means he's going to be able to help out no matter what. And our only pacifist. She's clean. She's a fast learner and loved by animals. A bit old, but that medical and animal skill is going to help us. As for what we're starting with... A strange knife made of hardened blood. Two longbows, a heavy club, and a pickaxe. And a male and female cow. I figured... Th and I also decided to have a start with some bed rolls. Obviously made of human leather. So hence the point limit. Yeah, I wanted to see how much it would cost in... Yeah. Went a little overboard, but I think this is a good start. I'm not going completely OP. So, be right back as we, I set everything up for the beginning. Whew, okay, did a lot of... As you can see, I haven't even finished. But yeah, a lot of work. Alright, people got bows. Alright, Gru, as much as I want you... You know what? How about with the plant harvesting? Yeah, so my thought is we're going to turn this whole valley into a compound. Ooh, black wolf. I feel like that's the name of like a book or a movie or something. Black Wolf. I don't know. That that feels like a name of something, and I don't know what. Okay, we got a chem fuel pond, two steam geysers. Yeah, it doesn't look like much of anything else. Okay, we're gonna need table. Some stools. Let's 
Suppose I should be happy that we have Deconstruct that. be a bit cramped but it'll be fine hang on okay rice fiber corn smoke leaf wait no that shouldn't be smoke leaf that should be heel root Cotton and a thing of this. And this is where some corn is going to be, so. We just need to finish work on this ASAP. Yep. That shit there. That shit there too. Can't do anything like that, unfortunately. the most comfortable but at least we found a legendary first come first serve on that it's definitely gonna be sleeping on the floor <sighs> All right, yeah, I'm thinking we're going to dig that way and use it as a natural sort of funnel. I mean, that's the plan, but you know how it is with plans. 
Plans have a way of getting screwed over. Well, at least we got our cows. Our cows are safe. We have plenty of... Hmm... Okay, okay, we'll make it a little bigger for you. Cows do eat a bit. Okay, what should we hunt? Ooh, what's that? Grab that. If I could find some cold crystals, that'd be great, because they'll basically act as a freezer. Okay, that's glowstone and... Oh, that's uranium. I, I looked at... I overlooked that. Uh, no, that's glowstone. Glowstone, but still good. Also, we got blood. Okay, I am not comfortable with Okay, this is going to be a bad idea, but Yeah, I don't want this thing hunting our cows or you know us. Uh oh. I didn't see her there. Oh no, you don't. All right, you're going to be okay. Just uh give yourself a bit of a tend. And, uh, you should be fine.
Yeah, we're gonna get some baby cows. Well, you're a little out of time, but... Whoa. I don't like seeing those things moving around so quick. Like, those things... They got legs. They got legs for days. <laughs> uh, I love that. Oh, and it got. Oh, it got its ass whooped by that. Huh. Alright, let's see what you got. You got a crossbow. Now, I could declare war on him. But I don't think his stuff is worth declaring war on his faction. some stuff here and Alright, so the first thing I'm going to want to do is meat smoking. We need to start smoking some of this meat. Otherwise, we're just going to lose it permanently and that's going to suck. Oh my god, that was an epic maneuver. There we go. Okay, I decided to move on. Seriously, my, my butthole was tightening seeing that. I 
know it's a little TMI, but that is how it felt. It just whoop. Okay, at least I can get... At least I get the bones out of there. Rue, what did you see? that tree let's move it in here seems like a conversation piece that conversation being Cthulhu for talk <sighs> well at least it's nice in here Maybe just work on this for now. <sighs> Need to think. Nah, I'm not. I was gonna say inconspicuous, little bit. We're gonna call it Iris. Yeah, when people ask, why'd you call it that? I don't know. It just seemed like a pretty good name. You know what? Let's stick around into the home area for now and... Hmm... Or not. Because we could tame them. Well, I'm going to butcher them, but hey, I want that stuff. That's some good stuff. I want the secret stuff that Michael used. You know the stuff. Hmm. It's made of granite. I would I'd probably want to replace that with the slate. That we're definitely gonna collect. Yep, evil spooky tree.
Didn't even chop it down for wood, apparently. At least that's a little bit of beauty. You should take that inside. I, I don't know. Feels like something you should. I mean, we probably don't want to lose that. Okay, new plan. Oh, crap. Run. Okay, we're gonna have to build you we're gonna build you a door. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out. For now, we'll, you know what, I'll just set up a door here. Then when we deconstruct that, we'll put a door there, and yeah. Well, at least we're going to get a lot of fur. Ah, our first catch of the day. Yeah, you're a boozer. Which, in that case, means that uh, you already marinated yourself, so... Sounds good. So let's greet uh, tonight's di dinner. Hey there, how you doing? Yeah? Oh god! <laughs> uh, we coming for you. You're a dead man. You're a dead man. How's it feel to know you're about to die? I don't know, why, why don't you ask yourselves? Oh, and look, he even brought cocktails for tonight. Hey. All right, we'll even take a skull because... 
Skulls are awesome. I don't get enough, but yeah, who knows, maybe. It's really annoying to lose all, you know, all that stuff, all, all you know, all this stuff from, yeah. Well, I'd say let's just celebrate. Oh, you are, you are wasted. To resort to that. Well, it even tells you who the skull is. I guess we're staying home. Okay. 
Hmm. Uncultured but insatiable. You're really good at mining. And you're a... Celestial? Okay. Yeah. He might be the chosen one. Let's tame him for a... Let's tame him. And uh, we're going to need to make him a... Rudimentary prison cell. Mm. No, that's... Mm, that's not gonna work. Uh... Ch -ch -ch. Uh, yeah, I guess I could build it in here. Okay, you're gonna try and do that. If we can tame him, it'll be easier to basically imprison him. Here, you want some blood? You don't want some blood. I need to get another dedicated crafter or something. Okay, so, 50, 41, 45, 50, 49, uh, hmm, didn't I have a steel club? All right, you know what? We're going to give it a shot. Hey, you're coming with me. You're coming with me. It's a pretty difficult. Oh my god! Look, he's already healing himself! Oh, but we got him! Alright. Good work. Well, I guess it's still where we're going to have our corn, but, yeah. Alright, we're going to first work on converting him. Wait, you were married to the faction leaders? 
Huh. That's a side punch. <laughs> oh, star, really? Oh. <laughs> Ugh. You're lucky it's only where that guy, otherwise it would have been a lot worse. Did you just use our medicine on that? A knight. Yeah, right. Yeah, you can go die. I think he'll be fine. Yeah, maybe don't use bone marrow because we can actually eat that as is. Enough human leather. Uh, all right, I guess an insect chitin sitting thing should be comfortable. Question mark. You're a fun-loving psychopath who's a really good artist, decent at mining and plants. You were a cult child, too. I mean, we would have to arrest you and make you our bitch, but... Sure. So, we'll just keep you in the home area and, uh... I don't know, we'll train you out of hall. Who's a good Joris? You're a good Joris. You're an ecologist, so you're incapable of violence, caring, and social. <laughs> uh, how the hell you get along a good life? Yeah, I think you're gonna. Mm, should I? I'm kind of want to just stay inside. I just want to stay inside in my little compound. Wishing that my ship wouldn't, uh, get all fucked over like this. from Rimafeller. Yeah, right, put that one in.
Converting you is just going to be the hard part. You're independent, but you're a prisoner, right? Maybe I do need to tame you. Hmm. Well, at least I got plenty of bones. Alright, well, I guess give it a shot. More. Okay, a lot more space, which means... Cows that aren't going to die horribly. At least that's the hope. Wow. All right. Okay, now I think it's going to be easier. So, we need a speaker of knowledge. So that means it's gonna be somebody who's a good talker. And I'm thinking. Oh, right, you're asleep. Okay, so now I just need to figure out what will be a good spot to make our church. Hmm. I didn't say, I said no underground bases. I didn't say anything about not making an underground church. Yeah, once we recruit... Okay, once we get him in and... What do you mean you need apparel? Oh. That's annoying. Because we can't make a visage mask until... Oof. So we're going to have to deal with that a little later, aren't we? Crap. Hey. Knock it off! Okay!
Hey, uh, you good there? You good, man? Yeah, I could have sworn I had a steel club somewhere around here. Like one of them big, large ones. Ugh. All right. Could you uh, make a heavy club? I'm gonna give that pick to him once we somehow get him. Ooh, heat stroke. Ugh. Right. There's a kibble out of blood's berry, blood berry and rice. Okay, I know you're a celestial and you're. <sighs> really? Hey, Gru. Gru, that's enough. Ugh. Damn! What'd you do to the... Wow, good work. Ugh. Freaking hell! We can't lose him. I know he's a Celestial, and he probably would just come back, but it's going to be really annoying to have to not butcher him. Like, yeesh. Think for a moment. Ugh. I like that one. I like that design. Yeah, I don't have anybody who could be a priest of corruption. Hmm, that's weird. Alright, let's try this conversion ritual. Let's see if this will work. The eyes gaze upon thee. Hmm. I think you're... You went up. Ugh. Some days just suck, don't they?
let's see if this works. Nope. Could try removing your legs. That might make us feel better. No ocular trees. I want some. Oh, that's why we we got that. Wait. Oh yeah, you're part of the tribal corruptors. That's why we got that. Teresa, I love you, but focus on this. Yeah, on that side. <sighs> Anything out here I should be thinking about? Tame some of these. Whoa, how did that get killed? Oh, Ward got it. Huh. So, Gru, how do you feel? Hungry? Well, go eat, I guess. Put the rotten corpses in there. Now I'm not even going to start the whole religion until first we got Bundy and then we can start, you know, building into here. I might even have him be the one to lead the charge into there. I mean, he is a celestial and he pretty much is going to be really tough to take down. By the way, the odds for a Celestial. Yeah. 1%. I did lower the resurrection time, but yeah. This guy's going to be a real game changer once we can get him on board. Yeah, not a matter of if, when. He'll have to join us eventually. Yeah, I'll be so glad when this is done. Oh, and we got the female. Good. It's bonded, but I can't give it to. Yeah. Okay, so for Fumalups, we're not going to have a lot. One male, one female. <sighs> of course. Yo, see your tits? Calm them. God damn it. What are you 
you guys hate each other so much? Oh, it's because we're eating non-cannibal food, so everybody kind of hates each other because we're not getting the cannibal food. We're gonna need to summon a raid. We need the meat. We need the meat! We need to call dinner. Oh, you go no, you no, no. Come on, dinner. Come on, dinner. Dinner time. Come on, come on, come on, dinner. Come on, dinner. Da da da. Yeah, I would say that worked. Hey, hey, quit your, quit your dancing. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick your ass. Yeah, I'm coming for you. I, I just need to think about it. Uh, yeah. Yinga, yinga, yunga. Uh, we'll deal with him later. Oh, ho, ho. let's capture him and sacrifice him. Oh, and he even had a bit of jade on him. I guess since this whole place is all enclosed. Hey, hey, all right, you enjoy your time on the outside because uh, it's going to be a while before you get to go back in. Uh, no, we are not sacrificing Bundy. Right, we just got to wait for you to... able to walk uh where did you guys come from Full, the full cheese. Uh, 
Uh, what do you got? I tell you what, we'll give you. No, that's not a very good deal. Yeah, I'll trade you some of these for some of the food, the medicine, and one of your fine cigars. Puffin' on luxury. Look, if you want to do trade, get over here. You dumbasses. Oh my god, it's the crab man! It's the crab man! Oh, yeah! You know what? Bash her brains in, too. Yeah, we need... We need the human flesh. We demand the flesh! Begin butchering! Once we really start getting into a lot of raids, we're going to be able to get a lot more food and a lot more human meat. I might even see if there's a mod just to grow it. How awesome would that be? Oh, good. You might want to fix that. Okay, what do you have in the way of weaponry? Not much. You know, wood axe, I mean, that's kind of neat, but... Eh.
Well, at least so now we can start eating. Ugh. Freaking hell! Come on, don't don't do that. Don't do that. Don't be a dick. Well, we're starting to get there. No, no, no. Sorry, sorry. There we go. Now let's try this. Mm-hmm. Hold that thought. You know what? Actually, and come on in. Let's see, you are a edgy, fast learner, and you are super immune and lazy. Hmm, sounds like dinner to me. Hmm. Fifty percent chance we'll get a recruit, but I guess we didn't get it. Oh my god. Did you really? Did you really, man? Ugh. Whatever you have, you gotta ditch. Okay, we're just gonna... Yeah. Just, uh, we're gonna just do a bit of a procedure, don't worry. It'll be A-okay. You'll wake up, and it'll all be good. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, that's cute. You think you can accept this? <laughs> yeah, no. so happy when we can get this guy and on that note I should probably leave now yeah seems like a pretty good time to call it what happened through this and I'd say we got a decent enough start well, all things considered. Although. I mean, we already got all this food. Let's get more. Let's get more food. Let's end on a good note.
Begin the feast. Yeah, that's right. Dig in. Enjoy. Devour. Fuck. Well, it did give some people, uh, yeah, that one, it will occasionally give us, like, a bonus to their, they'll get, like, a health bonus randomly, and yeah. Ugh, a heat wave. God damn it. There's something I can do. I can summon a trade caravan. Pet dealer from the Society of Elder Things, aka uh, Slavers, I believe. Yeah, gotta gotta love those guys. Mm mm mm. You don't fuck with them. You know what happened to the last species that decided to fuck with them? Actually, the last species I decided to fuck with them kind of kicked their asses. Let's do that. That way... We can cook more. Did you just growl at me? Uh. Oh! Uh. Huh. Hey, uh, how about I just trade with you before you decide to kill each other again? I mean, lemon tea would be kind of nice if I could afford it. Yeah, how about you just uh, get the hell off my property and stop bleeding all over it. get back to work so next time Groot you're done with wardening at the moment for now on your focus is research we need to get a lot of this done and you are just getting this is getting really irritating <sighs> but whatever. See you next time.